everyone, this is Christ169. Today's topic is going to be about Black Lives Matter, how useless they are. Please stand by. Hey guys, Christ169 here coming to you live or pre recorded, uploaded by Power Spectrum Internet. I'm here, you're there. Now let's get on with this whole damn show. Okay, I think Black Lives Matter is a useless entity only because of the recent years. They've been around in existence. They have done nothing for no one except themselves. It's very easy to tell you how if you're a racist if you don't support their ideology. They'll tell you how fast racist you are if you don't run out there and say Black Lives Matter or not. They'll tell you all this crap to tell you this garbage because they want you to feel sorry for, for them. Listen, I don't give a damn about Black Lives Matter. If you support a, 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 a movement that says everybody's fault but their own for the problems that they create, you are an idiot. You are a moron, and you need to have yourself just, I don't know, jump off a building or something. No, we don't, we don't do that. But I'm saying it's something that has to be addressed mentally and physically. Something's wrong with you. You need a whole new kind of retard you are. This is what goes on in Black Lives Matter movements. You have founders of Black Lives Matter going to non-black neighborhoods. Why is that? Why are they buy a two million dollar house in non-black neighborhood? Let's see. They're gonna get shot and robbed. That's why. They know why they're doing it. I know why they're doing it. You guys don't seem to care about that much. And that's fine. If you're a dilettante peasant slave who goes yes master every time they walk by, fine. Fine. Give them a yes master and move on your day. Okay? Give them a yes master and move on your day. But if you're like me, and I'm sick and tired of hearing about Black Lives Matter and how useless they are, you know, the World Health Organization is just, it's just like Black Lives Matter. It takes millions, in this case, it takes billions of dollars into, into, into government monies and couldn't prevent the Al Qaeda bug or coronavirus from killing a bunch of, about, about a million people. So I think it's kind of useless. And Black Lives Matter is the same thing. They take hundreds of thousands of millions of dollars from their poor, idiotic fan base. And the blacks are still being shot and killed by the thousands in Chicago a year. Or all the George Floyd, you know, burned down the city, you know, you know, uh, uh, jamboree going on in Chicago. The 12 dead children in 2020. The same year that George Floyd, the same month that George Floyd was killed. No one knows, no one cares. Bad Mark, bad crisis for saying that. You're supposed to be yes master. Well, no, no I'm not a yes master. I'm like a damn pink boy too master. Because I don't play crap like that. I don't care if you, I don't care if you support Black Lives Matter. I don't care if you support any of this stuff. <coughs> I don't care if you support anything. I don't care what you support. All I care about is people have common sense into their brain cells and stop thinking they have to be the most useless organization on planet Earth. I mean, I met some you know, weird people in my life, okay? And never ever in my life I met more useless people than Black Lives Matter. These these people, you know, um, are ignorant. They've never been born. They don't know what, what, what slavery was what, what, what was caused. They just blame the white man for the problem because that's what their masters tell them to do. The same masters, the ancestors, voted to not free the slaves, to keep them in chain, and fought a war to keep them enslaved. But yet, here we are. 200 plus years later, still fighting the same war they fought 200 years ago. And you got people sticking middle fingers up, oh, Black Lives Matter. I'm like, you're, you're ignorant, prick, dillis, unslave. Shut up. You're a nobody. You worship your black, white masters. Be quiet. See, kind of funny how Black Lives Matter, these people are all the educated people from free tuition schools and they do the mill fingers and tongue they act a bunch of animals and they're not you know they wouldn't dare go down to Chicago and do that they'd be shot and killed with a dead body on the road or New York Harlem or Compton because they know they get their ass to beat because none of the black brothers would give two drops of piss about their ass and, that, and that's why you don't see them doing that. 
attack white American neighborhood because that's, that's the only thing they can attack. They go in Chicago and demand justice, they're going to be shot. Like it happened in, in, in many other Black Lives Matter chapters. One lady, Black Lives Matter chapter leader, was shot in the head and pretty much dead. Brain dead. She was gone. And the person who did it wasn't white. It was a black man. Of course, CNN's like, can't talk about that. Not poor, not poor. Yeah, it's Black Lives Matter, poor and dead. Oh, I'm sorry. To kill by my white. My fault. Dumb Mark. Dumb. Bad Mark. Bad. Thinking all lives matter. <laughs> what the hell is that? I haven't heard of. That's conservative talk. Or a child killed in a car at a Black Lives Matter rally. Killed by another non white individual. Bad Mark. Bad. Thinking that children, black lives, children matter. This, folks, is what Black Lives Matter is. A youth organization. And I talked to one of them one time. They got mad at me. One, it's called slavery. So go home and look in the mirror. And you're racist. No, I'm being serious. Tribal leaders sold, chiefs sold poor tribes into slavery. In Africa. And they look at me with a blank face. Because they know that I know the truth. And the color that Nancy Pelosi was wearing, solidarity colors, are tribal slave colors. Are colors of slave traders. In Africa. I know this because I, I grew up in education more than George Washington's racist, Abe Lincoln is this, and everything's evil. I grew up in education where we know the founding fathers. We knew about slavery. Slavery bad, so the war fixed that. But yet, here we are again, fighting about it all over again. Because nobody wants to sit there and talk about it. You know? Nobody wants to talk about the real issues in the world. We, we want to talk about how problematic evil it is to have anything other than just being yourself. You know, I miss the days of the 90s and 80s and 90s where you can go out and have a good time with a friend while being called racist. Go out there a good time without being called anything other than, hey, Mark, hey, Larry, hey, Theodore. Now you're, now you're racist if you don't turn in. It, it just, I think Black Lives Matter is a useless entity. And it ain't gonna prove me wrong because I know what it is. I'm not stupid. I know what Black Lives Matter is. It's a useless entity that's only there to cause trouble and chaos. They're not there to help. They're there to keep pouring gasoline on the proverbial fire. They're only there to keep pouring gasoline on the proverbial fire. They're not there to give a damn about anything. Hell no. Never have been and will be. They're the gasoline pyro people who are pouring gasoline on the fire that are already there. And they're going to blame everybody around them when it blows up. And, and this is the thing we deal with every day. And this is why I think Black Lives Matter is a useless organization. If you don't like it, I really don't care. It's my thought, my channel. I can say what damn well please. If you don't like it, I don't give two drops of piss what you think. If you agree with me, great. If you don't agree with me, don't care. I don't care either way. Because I'm an adult. And I don't have to be a dilettante peasant slave like everybody else is. I, I, I can be who I am. You know? So guys, this is Christ 169 saying peace, love. Uh, this is upload brought to you by me, myself, and I. I'll catch you guys later once again. Like, subscribe down below if you haven't already. Turn on okay, the